something that we're trying to teach our students at the University of Michigan is how to think about a different types of ownership models through the life cycle of a firm. How do you think about your employees? Um, how do you motivate them? How do you incentivize them? How do you engage them in decision making, empower them? All of those things I think are very important. Looking at a variety of different startups, looking at the challenges, the challenges they face, and extracting the principles that these entrepreneurs uh, learned um, from, from it and teaching it to our students. We actually had the protagonist, the entrepreneur, come into the class to debrief after the students really uh, analyzed and debated uh, what the entrepreneur should be doing in that situation. And it really provided a rich discussion and insights. A lot of our students uh, came out saying they had a much better view of how they would run their organization or even um, how they would uh, approach a, a crisis or a challenge um, along their journey of, of startup. There's so many different ways that employee ownership is expressed and I think packaging it in a certain way so that students, uh, young entrepreneurs understand them and they can adopt uh, bits and pieces of it within their organization. I think uh, developing a culture of ownership is something that a lot of people are they're doing. You know, organizations like Google, they definitely have a strong culture of engaging their their talent base, giving them opportunities to express themselves. I mean, even at Google, employees have the opportunity to spend you know, 10% of their time on something that they really care about, independent of their job title. Uh, at the symposium, I had a, a really phenomenal time uh, just networking, uh, meeting people who have uh, the same mindset and, and spirit. Um, so uh, it was a great time just talking to colleagues about what they're doing. Uh, what their big ideas are and how they see these employee ownership influencing their sphere of influence. Talking to colleagues who are in different entrepreneur hubs, so there's folks from Stanford talking, folks at MIT talking, and chatting with them about what they're seeing is it was very encouraging uh, for myself. I'm excited to go back to Ann Arbor uh, to talk more about the principles of employee ownership and continuing to teach it in our in our curriculum and in our incubator.